right, center, and left. To give you more time to adjust your listening, here we are on the left channel again. And now on the center, the channel which of course carries a large part of the dialogue in most films. And now on the right. Incidentally, the recordings you are listening to are identical, made with the same microphone and the same amplifiers, in order to make sure that any differences in quality do not spring from the test film itself. Now, in order to test the bass response, we will send you the deep tones of a piano. Imagine wasting a whole afternoon marking a deck of cards. By the way, did you bring them with you? You needn't feel badly. It wouldn't have done you any good. Because, you see, on rainy afternoons, my husband used to amuse me and himself by showing me the tricks of your trade. He was a professional gambler, too. I have an uneasy feeling that our honesty is being questioned. I think we're being asked to leave. So do I. Would you like us to go? As far as you like. Another continent, preferably. Au revoir, then. Arrivederci. When I checked the church calendar, I found a wedding schedule for two. Something can be done about the church. There's another point I had in mind. The uh, highest proportion of older factory workers, those who might want to attend the funeral, are found in the 7 to 3 shift. What difference does it make? The factories will be closed anyway. For the day? Yes, for the day. I suppose all you're thinking of is the money it'll cost. Not as a first consideration, but I did happen to recall Mr. Bullard pointing out at the time of Fitzgerald's death that a paid holiday would represent a loss to the company of approximately $87,000. And that figure, of course, was before the last wage raise. It'd be somewhat more at the current rates. Matt. Hello, Nikki. And Jim didn't hit you? No. He missed as usual. So he told you I was out there. Thank you, things. We're getting out of here. No, I'm not going with you. Whatever it was that made me want you, well, it's just gone now. 